so I'm about to do a facial. As you can see, my skin is like very dehydrated. So I'm gonna do a facial that is tailored towards dry skin. Okay. So the facial wash that I use is from Skin Script. You can only purchase it if you have a professional account. So I only use a little bit. You can't really see it because I already started to mix it on my hands. And I add a little bit of water. And You never want to like rub hard on your face. Now <clears throat> I'm gonna do my second cleanse. The first cleanse is usually to just remove any type of dirt, makeup that you may have, but I didn't have any, but I'm still gonna do my second cleanse. As you can see, my face is starting to look less dry. So now I'm gonna apply the exfoliator. And the exfoliator that, that I use is Biotherapeutic. And again, you do need a professional account. You always want to go up versus like doing this because as you can see from me scrunching and stuff and going like that I have lines at the top so that's to help prevent that now I'm not gonna exfoliate too much on my face because it's already dry but exfoliating is essential to get rid of that dry dead skin and you always want to work your way up and I'm always pushing up to lift lift and tone lift and tone lift 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 okay. now it is masking time so the mask that I'm going to use, so I do have the big container, but I just use the samples when I'm doing my video so I don't have to cross contaminate because it's not me using it. But typically if I was using from a bigger jar, then I would just dispense the amount that I am going to use. Now I'm going to use the Golden Honey Nourishing Mask because my skin is so dry. It's very thick. I'm just gonna spread it. Okay. 
and I'm going to leave this. I'm going to put some of my lips because those are dry too. And my nose area is extremely dry because I've been sick, so I've been blowing my nose a lot. Now, I leave my mask on for 10 minutes. I'm just trying to make sure I get everything off the brush. All right. <clears throat> so now during this time, when I'm masking, I'm usually cleaning up the stuff that I used, but I had these in the freezer. So this is also going to be like a cooling ice treatment that you can do at home. So if you have any type of jade rollers, you can always use those. And as you can see, I have a little puffiness. So what I'm doing is working all of that fluid on my eyes. And then with that, you have to drink lots of water so you can flush it out. And I'm going to keep doing this for 10 minutes. And you can do it on your neck too. So I removed the mask. Now I'm gonna use the peptide eye serum just because my eyes are a little puffy. And that's really due to my allergies acting up. And I'm not washing this off, so this is gonna stay on. <coughs> and then, I'm gonna use my toner. So the, I'm using the cucumber hydration toner and that's just another added um, hydration. And next is the moisturizer. Very, very important. And my skin is so dry because I have not been keeping up with my skincare routine but i'm gonna do much better so right now i'm gonna mix the citrus c nourishing cream so again remember up and up up and up up and up I'm avoiding my eye area because I don't want to wipe that part off. <clears throat> so I added the citrus cream. Now the hydration moisturizer. <clears throat> and you don't need a lot. A little goes a long way.
and a little extra, so I'm just adding it to my mix. And most importantly, even though I'm not leaving the house, <clears throat> sunscreen is still important. Because you may turn around and leave the house and there you go. Forgot your sunscreen. It is going to leave a light overcast. But that's okay. Because I'm not going nowhere. And we're all done. <clears throat> now, aside from the white overcast, my skin feels much better. It looks more hydrated, even if you can't really tell, but I'm going to give y'all an update tomorrow. Now, <clears throat> given the fact that I used so many products, um, during a facial, your skin is going to perch. So within like the next 24 to 48 hours, I may experience breakouts, which is very normal because that's basically your skin getting rid of all the gunk that did not come out during the facial. So if you ever go and get a professional facial and you start breaking out a few days later, completely normal. Just make sure you continue to finish your skincare routine on a daily basis and everything will resolve itself.